Good morning. It is uh, Tuesday, July 19th. It's uh, 622 here in Shenico and I'm up on the roof and the city has been buzzing this morning. Uh, there was somebody right outside our window for a while around 530 uh, trying to reverse and get into the right parking spot or something and uh, kept uh, running their backup uh, beeper and then I've been hearing the chicken buses since about 4 30 this morning the roosters have been crowing there's music out and about here in uh, the neighborhood here where we live and um, I guess people are ready to get moving um, I just spent some time in 1st Timothy uh, the last chapter chapter 6 and um, was uh, just you know, reflecting on uh, what it means to be rich and what uh, we need to be doing if we are rich. We need to make sure that we're being generous in our, in our giving and in our deeds. And uh, good reflections for this morning as I start my day. Uh, today I'm thinking, of course things are always subject to change here in Guatemala, but if you've been here you know what I'm talking about. But I think we're going to be back working on the house again today. Yesterday we uh, went to Ayapan in the morning and I uh, had the chance to speak to one of the classes and uh, that was interesting. I also had the chance to speak to a widow up in one of the um, small village uh, homes or whatever you would want to call it. And uh, the conversation was pretty nice but you can tell she is very upset about the road that's being built near Ayapan and uh, about the government. I uh, was not happy with the president at all. Um, that was an interesting adventure and then yesterday afternoon we worked on the house and we made some great progress on the second house this is a house that we're building for Maria another widow and um, I'm trying to still get the dynamics of who else is going to be living there I, I my understanding is that there'll be five people living in the house uh, but we'll see um, at any rate we made good progress I felt like uh, we learned a lot last week that is helping us be more productive and effective uh, this week so we'll see how it goes if we're building today I suspect we'll make some pretty good progress um, really things have gone well um, it's another cloudy morning um, yesterday turned out to be sunny so I will we'll see what happens here if the clouds break free uh, we are in the rainy season here in uh, in Shenico uh, so it's not uncommon that we would get rain or some sort of precipitation at some point during the day but hopefully it holds out because it makes building a whole lot easier and just walking around uh, the area. So I guess that's it. I want to make the video a little bit shorter today. Um, I'm still having trouble posting my one from this past Friday because it must have been too long and the, the bandwidth here, the, uh, the Wi-Fi bandwidth at the local internet cafe is too small to allow it to go through. Um, so most likely I'll be posting that when I get back into the States. Um, at any rate, I hope you are doing well. I hope that you are stretching. I hope that these um, rooftop reflections have helped you gain a little bit of perspective on what we're up to and maybe challenged you a bit to keep stretching and and uh, to consider doing something like this, going to Guatemala. That's it for now. Keep stretching and I'll talk to you tomorrow.